Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum students. How are you? I hope you all are doing well. And you all have seen the last lecture. In our previous lecture, we have started a new unit in English of class 2. That is unit 4, the sad elephant. We have read page number 29 in our last lecture. Today, we will continue the story from where we have left. So, take out your vision books. Now, we will continue from part 2. What happened in the part 1? Let me give you a quick review. There was an elephant in the zoo whose name was Raja. The name of the elephant was Raja. He was unhappy. He was unhappy or he was sad. Why was Raja sad? Because he did not like his own color and he liked the colors of cheetah, zebra and swans. So this is all what we have read in the part 1. And today we will start reading from page number 30. What happened? The elephant said, to his friend Raja that I am all grey, I have only one colour, I did not like my colour. So the parrot say the parrot said that don't be sad. The parrot stretched its right wing and put it on Raja's huge ear. She said that don't be sad, the cheetah is my friend. I will ask him to give some of his color to you. What did the parrot say? The parrot said that I will ask Cheetah to give some of his color to you because the Cheetah is my friend. So the parrot flew to the Cheetah. The parrot flew to the Cheetah and said, Cheetah, my friend, do you know that Raja, the elephant, is very sad? Do you know that Raja is very sad? The parrot said this to the cheetah. He does not like his grey color. Can you give me some of your color to Raja? So the cheetah gave the parrot some of his color. The parrot took the color and flew back to Raja. The parrot asked cheetah, to give some of his color for Raja because Raja was sad. So the cheetah gave the parrot some of his color. The parrot took the color and flew back to Raja. Raja put the brown color on his legs. Raja put the brown color on his legs. But Raja was still very sad. I am not happy. I am still grey. Who said this? Raja said this. I am not happy. I am still grey. Have you seen the tiger? It has beautiful orange color with black strips. Have you seen the tiger? It has beautiful orange color with black strips. So the parrot replied, don't be sad. The tiger is my friend. I will ask him to give some of his color to you. The parrot said to Raja, Don't be sad, the tiger is my friend. I'll ask him to give some of his color to you. The parrot flew to the tiger and asked, Tiger, my friend, do you know that Raja, the elephant, is very sad? He does not like his grey color. Can you give me some of your color to Raja? The tiger gave the parrot some of his color. The parrot took the color and flew back to Raja. Raja put on the orange color. Raja put on the orange color on his body. I'm not happy. I'm still grey. Who said this? Raja said this. 
Raja put on the orange color of the tiger on his body. But still he was unhappy. He said that I am not happy. I am still gray. My trunk is still gray. You have a beautiful green color. I like your green color. Can you give me some of your color? What did the Raja say? Raja said that I am not happy. My trunk is still gray. I like your beautiful green color. Raja said this to the parrot. Do you know what is a trunk? Raja said that my trunk is still gray. Yes, you can see that the gray part is known as the trunk. Raja was unhappy because the trunk was still gray. So he asked the parrot to give some of its color. The parrot gave the elephant some of his color to Raja. Raja wore it on its trunk. Raja wore it on its trunk. Raja swung his trunk happily. He swung his green trunk happily. Now I am happy. Look how beautiful I am. Now I am happy. I look beautiful. I am happy with brown legs, orange body and green trunk. Oh, I am very happy. Raja was very happy after putting on the green color on its trunk. What did the Raja say? Raja said that now I am happy. I look beautiful and I am happy with my brown legs, my orange body and green trunk. Oh, I am very happy. What happened? The next day, the children of a school come to visit the zoo. Zed, Zen, Saad, Zubair, Madiha and Tuba ran to the elephant stand. What happens? The next day, the children of a school came to visit the zoo. Zed, Zen, Saad, Zubair, Madiha and Tuba ran to the elephant stand. But why? Why did they run for, uh, towards the elephant stand? Because they want an elephant ride. They wanted an elephant ride. But what happens? As soon as they saw Raja, they screamed loudly. As soon as they saw Raja, they screamed loudly. A monster! A monster! The children saw Raja and they screamed loudly. They thought that Raja was a monster. They were afraid of the monster. They ran as fast as they could. They were afraid of the monster. They did not want to go to Raja. They did not want to go near Raja at all. Raja was again very sad. He said to the parrot, The children didn't like my color. Raja said to his friend parrot, the children didn't like my color. They did not ride on me. I don't want all these colors. Please make me gray again. Raja said that the children didn't like my color. Please make me gray again. The clever parrot said, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala created us in the best form. The clever, the shrewd parrot said that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has created us in the best forms. We must be thankful to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for being what we are. We should be thankful to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. The parrot took away all the colors and returned them to the animals. The parrot took away all the colors and returned them to the animals. Now, Raja was very happy to be gray again. Raja was very happy to be gray again. So, what is the message of this story? That we should be happy and thankful for what we have. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has created 
each and every person in his or her best form so we should not make fun of anyone and we should not be unhappy for what we are we should be thankful to allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for what we are whatever we have because allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has created us in the best form allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has created us in the best form i hope that you like the story now thank you note down your homework read unit 4 thank you allah hafiz